Well, it's a rainy day here in South Carolina, but the Mustang is all packed up with the essentials. I got a tent, sleeping bag, a chair, an awning, and uh, some clothes. And that's it. And we're headed to Missouri from South Carolina. <laughs> Say he's a nut job. <laughs> we want to head from South Carolina to Missouri on what I think is going to be a great road trip. Who knows what we might see? Never been to Missouri before that I remember. All right, here we go. Today's the day, and uh, we got all of our camping stuff loaded. Car is ready. We got our uh, QR codes if people want to scan them. And we stopped and we're going to get in the car and we're going to hit the highway for what I think will be a great road trip. On my way out of town, I got to make one quick stop at the DMV to turn that tag right there in from an old vehicle I've got there that I not driving anymore so hopefully after a quick if that is a such thing trip up here to the dmv we'll start logging some miles quick and painless but apparently now you have to fill out paperwork to turn the tag in that's a new one on me used to those little wooden boxes and just went in and dropped it in oh well onward let's let's head somewhere and see something Okay, somewhere I have picked up a rattle. And it has to be something I've packed because it just started. And that's gonna drive me nuts until I find it. See if you can hear this. Hear that? Sounds coming from over there somewhere. It's gonna drive me eight. I gotta find a rattle, so we're stopping where I can unpack and repack because the rattle's gonna drive me absolutely out of my mind. Welcome to Georgia.
toward Welcome Center. Continue for three... I gotta find the rattle. I gotta find it. The rattle is driving me out of my skull. I, can't I gotta find figure it. out what it is. I can't find it. I can't find it. I moved a bunch of stuff around, but nothing makes that sound. It seems uh, to have stopped. It's not doing it now. I moved a bunch of stuff around. I moved a bunch of stuff around, but I didn't, uh, I, I, I don't know. I don't know. for a hamburger or a ham bone or a chicken leg or you know what what whatever whatever we can find tree rat I'm 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 open minded right now well that little spot back there I think they call it a town uh <laughs> even the fleas were looking for something to bite back there so that was not a place to find a sandwich. The hunt for a sandwich continues. I tried to find a local place. I really did. But after about 45 minutes, I gave up. <laughs> it got to where I was seeing fewer and fewer places. So I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to get the next place I see. We'll go to local later. Um, shout out to Brian Harrison for the uh, sandwich today. We got us a hamburger. Um, if you don't know, let me explain why that shout out happened in the video in this video there'll be a link in the videos in the past i have put a link that you can uh you can give a small donation to the channel if you want to um it's a it's a link it's open it comes straight to me you can you can do 25 cents you can do 25 dollars you can do 200 dollars. whatever you want to do you put in your amount you want to and it comes straight to me and uh Mr. Harrison sent us a little money and uh, we enjoyed a hamburger on him today. So we greatly appreciate that. Now I'll get back on the road because we've got about two hours to where I'm stopping at for today. So I made it all the way to Nashville, Tennessee. As you can see right there is the skyline of Nashville, Tennessee. And right, let me back up, right there 
is the car. So, made it to Nashville, Tennessee. Kind of an uneventful ride. Kind of not much to see, not much to do. But in the morning, I think, I'm still working out the details, but I think I might be meeting up with a couple of folks and maybe we'll have a good road trip kind of cannonball in together if we can get everything coordinated. Um, if not, then may just leave out early and try to make some side trips and uh, give y'all something to see. I don't know. I don't know exactly how it's going to play out. Y'all hang in there. Um, I done a poll and y'all asked for a road trip video and a racing video to be separate. So we're doing a road trip video and maybe we can actually find something cool to see on the road trip. Uh, right now it's kind of been laid back. But it's been a good trip. Uh, I kind of like a quiet trip. It means I don't have to work on stuff. You know what I mean? But, uh, yeah, tomorrow's the day. Tomorrow's the day all the action gets started, at least for us. we got to go through tech and get our pit spots and camp spots and all set up. So, yeah, yeah. Let's, uh, <laughs> I'm going to get some rest. The next time y'all see me, we'll be on the road again. Good morning there, Nashville. Hey guys. Well, it's morning, and the uh, car's still down there. Got a lot of company, but it's still there. That's a, that's, a, that's a positive. This morning, we are meeting up with Hot Rod Guy Garage and his little Fox Body. Is it an S? SV, SVT, SVO, it's a SV something. <laughs> I can't keep up, I don't remember. But he's got a little Fox Body Mustang. He is gonna be coming in this way from a different direction than I was, and he should be in shortly. We're gonna leave here and ride out at a little mom and pop breakfast joint and meet him there. And then we're gonna cannonball the rest of the way to the no name nationals together. So today's road trip should be a little more exciting than yesterday's road trip. At least there'll be something to see. You know what I mean? There'll at least be another Mustang. <laughs> well, hopefully she's all rested up because it's gonna be another day. All right, I am on my way to uh, like Jeff's home cooking or something like that. That's where I'm meeting up with Russell from Hot Rod Guy Garage and check out his cool little fox body. Serious question for you guys that do this all the time. Of course, hotels are never in the middle of nowhere like they should be, but I try to do avoid highways and stuff, but when you stay somewhere, especially like Nashville, there is no avoiding anything. How do you guys that live in cities like this actually do it? I, I've been in this little intersection for two seconds and I'm already about to spaz out from all the traffic. I just don't, I don't understand how you people can do this. How do I, you're psychopaths. Every one of you are psychopaths. That's all I know to say. Okay, first off in my defense, I always try to do local stuff and all the photos online, it almost looked like we was gonna have trouble finding a parking spot. There's 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 three cars in a parking lot. Did, what did they pay people for a photo shoot? Or is eight o'clock just late for their breakfast rush? I I may have gotten hoodwinked here. But there it is. There's, there's Russell Hot Rod Guy Garage. His little fox. That scoop's super cool on that thing. That's uh, the 
case I uh, have not said this, that's Russell from Hot Rod Guy Garage there with his little uh, fox body. We're cannonballing down to Saxton, Missouri for the No Name Nationals. Hey, y'all go over there and give his channel a, uh, a comment on one of his videos. Uh, Hot Rod Guy Garage. Just go over and comment on one of his videos and tell him I sent you. Uh, if enough of you go over and comment, maybe he'll buy me a hamburger or something. And I'm, I'm a fat guy, so I like I like food. So uh, y'all go over there and give him a uh, give him a comment, maybe a thumbs up, and uh, yeah, we're gonna cruise down the road here for a little while. We decided to jump on the interstate to make some miles. Uh, we're not far away. We just want to get these miles under our belts. So. Y'all hang in there, the road trip, it does continue. We have made it to Kentucky. Some number of states yet to go. I'm not sure. I failed geography maybe, I don't know. But we've made it to Kentucky. The little uh, Mustang Mafia hit crew. <laughs> Russell over playing on his laptop, trying to make it like a thousand horsepower. <laughs> there we are. Oh, step in the shade for a minute. Listen, we're going to road trip from here. I think the next stop will actually be Saxton, Missouri. Unless, you know, we make another stop between there. But uh, hopefully you enjoy some of the road trip footage. If not, I do understand it is not exactly the most exciting footage. But to the next video you see after this one, all race car stuff. Hey, there's burnout contest, there's bracket, grudge, 25 small tire racing. There's all kind of racing going on. So the video you see after this one will be all about racing. But there's a, there's a cool part to the end of this that when we get there tonight, we're going to go to a place called Lambert's to eat. It's the home of the thrown bread. They actually throw bread at you. Kind of curious to see what that's all about. There we are. A pair of Mustangs. Terrorizing the interstate. <laughs> Kentucky. Hey, hey, Kentucky. What in the shit is going on with your roads? Uh, seriously. I gave up rodeo a long time ago. But I feel like I need to pull the old bull rope out. You know what I mean? Let's put some rosin on my ass. What is going on with these roads? You can't find a smooth spot. What are you doing?
an ocean over there. But in fields over here. That sign back there said, road may flood. This bridge is big enough for a ship to go under. If this road floods, there's some serious Noah's Ark shit going on. Look at that bridge. Take some fish in that water. Lord, I don't know where the other end of this bridge is. It's She's a big one. Turn right onto Ohio River Scenic Byway, US Highway 51 North. Lord, this road ain't wide enough for that thing. Lord, Lord. That's the neighborhood when the church has a fence around it. Mama says, I believe we in the get to. state line we have officially made it to Missouri looks like we have oh about 29 miles to the racetrack we have officially made it to Missouri um, welcome to Missouri well thank you um, yeah I can't say there's a <laughs> can't see so far there's a whole lot to see seen some water there's a field over there some trees there folks over there earning their money while well, they're getting in their crop can't tell from here what the crop is but getting them in got up here. We might be burning stuff on the side of the road there. 
Hey, that smelled really good in here. Oof. Turn left on the county road 448, then turn right. Turn right, then your destination will be on the left. Here we are. We got our little slice of heaven back here in the back corner of the track. I hope the weekend gets a little more organized than what it is because it's supposed to go to Lambert's at five o'clock. It's not five o'clock yet. But we're standing here in the pits and we're just in a mass exodus of vehicles. Nobody has come said anything. Nobody's come said it's time. Uh, actually, I was told by somebody else before I got here that it's supposed to be five o'clock. Nobody's given me an official time. So I suppose we're supposed to leave now to go to Lambert's. I, I have no idea. So yeah, I guess, I guess we'll head to Lambert's now and wrap this video up with home of the throne of bread. <laughs> Let's see what this place is all about. Well, we've made it to Lambert's. Hadn't made it inside yet, but I want to take the rail buggy home. Come to a race car, hot rod thing, and I want to take the rail buggy home. I guess it says a lot about me. Time to head inside and see what this home of throne bread's all about. Oh, another room back there. I wonder who the special people are to get to sit right there. That's So, picking up a couple last minute supplies, headed back to camp. My thoughts on Lambert's. The food was delicious, really was. The food was great. I, I'm debating on whether it was overpriced or not. Or I shouldn't say overpriced, but I should say expensive. But the food was great, the crew was great. Uh, the experience was probably worth the extra of what I think that the price was. Either way, hopefully y'all enjoyed this video. The next one you see will probably come out on Sunday or Monday, and it's going to be all racing content. So God bless y'all. Hope the Lord bless you more today than he did yesterday. The be the glory, guys. We are going to see you on the next one. <laughs>